The new series of Call the Midwife recently started with fans reunited with all their favorite characters from Donata's house. Among them was long-standing and stern non-sister Julianne, played by Jenny Agutter, who has been part of the series since it began in 2012. Call the Midwife continues this evening, January 8, on BBC One at 8pm with another heartwarming and devastating installment to leave viewers in tears. Sister Julianne will be facing some challenging cases after she encounters an expectant mother at a coffee morning. Sadly, after the woman experiences some breast discomfort, she gets a tragic diagnosis which leaves her heart broken. The new series will also see midwife Lucy Landerson, Leonie Elliott, have her own health problems. Elsewhere, nurse Sheila Turner, Laura Main, will be helping to organize celebrations for the Whitson Maypole. Who is Jenny Agutter married to? Agutter, 70, is married to Swedish hotelier Johan Tham after the pair met at an arts festival in Bath, Somerset in 1989. They tied the knot a year later and welcomed their son Jonathan in December 1990. Her son is now a GP in London. The actress and her husband are said to split their time between their home in South London and their house on the Lizard Peninsula in Cornwall. She said being married was lovely and very grounding, admitting her marriage continued to flourish through the years. Agutter told the Daily Mail in 2022, one of the things about meeting people and forming relationships as an actor is that others have an idea of who you are before they meet you. That's hard in any relationship, particularly with men. When Johan and I met I did not feel he had any sense of who I was at all, but he wanted to find out, and that made a big difference. I'm still finding out about him 31 years on. The star got hitched to the hotelier when she was in her late 30s following on from a whirlwind romance. Prior to meeting him, she had decided to avoid relationships and had lived in Hollywood for 17 years. He initially moved into her Los Angeles pad but the pair later relocated to the UK. Agutter previously told The Express in 2012 how he'd saved her after from herself. She said, I had got stuck in my ways, ran my life the way I wanted, took holidays when I wished and went where I wanted. I did have long relationships but they all ended. Dot the star continued, I was thinking, maybe I will just remain single. And, more worryingly, what does the future hold? Then all this came at once with Johan. It came as a shock but it was the best thing that happened. Agutter went on to say, as I reached my late 30s, before I met Johan, the gynecologist told me, you might find it difficult to become pregnant because of your age but I don't see any problems. She was 36 when she got married but said she didn't have any problems conceiving her son. Call the Midwife airs on BBC One tonight at 8pm, 